Hello everybody, it's Boaz Faller and I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for October 27th, 2016. The moon is void of course most of the day if you are in Central Europe up to uh, 3 p.m. when it moves into, that's uh, 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, when it moves into Libra, bringing an energy that is much more concerned and about relationships and the parts we play in front of other people and among other people in our lives. Even though it's void, of course, it will be in a Yod configuration with Sirius and Juno, which means that we could be a little too demanding today, especially with our long-term relationships. This is not a day to ask for too much. This is a day to cherish the people in our life and what they are giving us. It's a day to acknowledge what we already have. Later on, at around 6 p.m. Central European time, that's 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, there would be a sextile to Vesta. This is a great time to reconnect to your holy place, to your sacred fire, to things that are most important and influential for you in your life in a positive manner. Later on, the moon will be going into a conjunction with Jupiter. It's, a generally, it's generally a great time of benevolence, of optimism, and a, a lot more of um, emotional confidence. But if some of us in Europe will be sleeping through the night, we could have very interesting, blissful dreams. The Sun and the Mercury are in a state called Kazimi. Mercury is in the heart of the Sun. These are the days to imagine to the smallest details how you want your future to look like, how you want yourself to, what kind of role you want yourself to play in the future and believe in it. And that would have a long-term implication. Not only that, Venus, the planet of relationship and satisfaction, is squaring the nodes. Who we are in relationship to other people in our lives, the parts we play, is of influence, is influential for a very long time. This is a watershed period in which we could change, we could become better, we could become greater, we could become better human beings in the relationships we lead in our life. And I'm not talking only about the romantic personal ones, any kind of relationship in your life. And that goes and applies as well to the way we draw in funds and money to our life and satisfaction to our life. This is a time that we could change and better our ways. That's it for today. I want to thank you for listening. This is Boaz Feiler. Goodbye.